Danny Bonaducci, Life Coach. We're going to start right now. It is Danny Bonaducci, brought to you by Goldberg Jones. My friend Rick Jones is in the studio today. So if you have like divorce, child custody, um, uh, child care, um, uh, what's it called when they give you the money? <laughs> I can't oh, spousal about. maintenance. Spousal. I don't want to maintain my spouse. I just want to <laughs> give her money into the hell out of my life. Child support. That's what I meant. Ah. All those questions, man. We got a full blown expert today. But watch this. You ready? Your wife went out and she was bad again. So call one eight hundred divorce for men. Uh, uh, I'm loving it. Uh, I'm uh, loving uh, it. Uh, uh. That's my friend Rick Jones from Goldberg Jones Divorce for Men. Uh, he is my personal attorney and my personal friend, and he kicks ass and takes names. Matter of fact, he does that. If you want your uh, ex husband or your ex wife not to have a name anymore, he'll take that. He's that badass. <laughs> All right, so Rick Jones from Goldberg Jones is in here. Uh, call 1 800 Divorce for Men if you need him. And uh, let's go down the line. You want to pick him? Oh. We're going to put you on with Kevin in Auburn. Kevin, what's up, buddy? Um, not much. Uh, do you have a question for my friend Mike uh, uh, Jones or Rick Jones, the uh, uh, from Goldberg well, Jones one eight hundred divorce? Yeah, um, I, I, uh, my ex is abusive to my daughter, and uh, she keeps sending me text messages saying that she can't uh, handle her and she doesn't want her. She's going to give her up to the state. She sends me text messages saying that. Uh, She's going to sign custody over to me. I promise this time. She sent me several of them. Are they legal in court? Have, have she ever threatened uh, the child in any way? Yeah, oh, yeah. And you've got that in writing and on text? I don't have. I got rid of the text where she's threatened them. But you've got, the, you've, got, you've got in writing that she promises to turn over the child? Yes. This one's too easy for me, so I will have to go to my compadre, uh, Rick Jones from the uh, law firm of Goldberg Jones called 1 800 Divorce. Rick, kick some ass, take some names, buddy. Yeah, you really need to call me. <laughs> no, I, certainly text messages uh, is one of the uh, you know, most important ways to really give the court sort of a feel for what's going on on a day to day basis. He also so, has written letters, too. Yeah, the, 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 those things certainly, uh, text transcriptions, all of those things can be provided to court. So if he goes in there and he, you've done none of these things in return, correct? Right. All right. So if you go in there and you slam them down on the judge's uh, desk and you're represented well by my friend Rick and she's represented by whoever, you've got threatening letters and I promise and I promise to give you the kids back. Does he pretty much slam dunk win this one? You know, I, I actually wish it was that easy, but there's a little bit more to do it, and this is why you need a team behind you. Right. Because in addition to that, the biggest piece of the puzzle is going to be your declaration. So you frame this all up, and those pieces you're talking about are simply evidence that gives you credibility. The other yeah. issue is from your da daughter's perspective. How old is she? She is 17 months now. Oh, Okay. Well, never I'm mind. She doesn't have much of her before. perspective at this point. Uh, yeah, no, not a lot of credibility uh, on the same Okay. Month. Well, you know, <laughs> that being the case, though, those letters and those text messages that you're talking about are probably going to have even more of an impact if we're talking a 17 year old because it's going to rise to the level, in my right. opinion. Right. Uh, it, uh, of what? Life's, uh, life's, yeah, it's going to yeah, it's going to rise to the level of court being very concerned about this child's the safety. Welfare of the baby, yeah. absolutely. So, hey, if you want more information on that, because it is theoretically that easy, but you get into a courtroom, which I've gotten into a lot, because I do this, I know how to do this and everything. Till I get to a courtroom and there's line C if you want a driver's license, and line D if you want a divorce, and line A if you want to get married. The paperwork stuff is really difficult. I would suggest you call one eight hundred divorce and you get Rick on your side and you get your kid in. A Big ass hurry, okay, man? Okay. All right, cool. This is Danny Bonaducci, Life Coach, with special guest Rick Jones from 1 800 Divorce. The, the only next... man to ever guest on Life Coach, by the way. The next caller is Mike in Federal Way. Mike in Federal Way, what can we do for you? Hey, how you guys doing? Um, got a question for you. I was recently divorced in December. Um, when I was divorced, I was on active duty in the Army. In February of this year, I Did retired. Did she file before or after she found out you were going? When I was, uh, before I filed, or she filed before I retired from the Army. Well, well I, I, think, on I think she should be shot for treason, but that's just me. I agree with you. Thank you. Um, my, my question is, my child support was based upon my active duty pay, which was roughly around 5000 a month. 
um, since then, uh, since I retired, I'm working for a company where I'm making about eleven fifty an hour right now. Right. And the child support payments are basically killing me. And I'm trying to find a way where I can get my payments lowered so that I can actually live within my means. Um, I've, I've contacted a couple lawyers, but nobody's been real helpful. So I'm hoping that you guys can help me out well, here. You, sir, have not contacted Rick Jones at 1-800-DIVORCE. Rick, what does this man do? Well, there's an upside and a downside. Let's go with the upside first. Good. The upside is you have had a substantial change of circumstance. Nobody would disagree with that. Your income is significantly lower, although... And while serving our country... Absolutely. Although the retirement uh, income that you're getting right now is considered income as well. So when you add that to your, to your hourly wage right now, whether or not there's still a material difference is going to be one of the keys. But if there is, then, that, then, then that's likely to be a substantial enough reason to go in and seek, based on economic hardship, a change to your child support. And will, will, he, will he lose a lot of cash on this when... when is this, is this like a 50-50 thing? Well, you know, I'd like to see a little bit more because, again, it's about figuring out how much of a difference it's going to make because if I can save him $25 a month, it's not worth him paying me to do it. Right, so you're going to go ahead and get a significant That's right. change. That's so right. I want you to call 1-800-DIVORCE and ask for Rick Jones, okay, my man? I will do that. Thank you, you very do. much. My pleasure. Thank you, and thank Rick Jones. 1-800-DIVORCE. Let's go to uh, line one. It's Michelle in Marysville. Michael. Uh, uh, Michael in low overhead Marysville. That's right. Oh, we hey. for everywhere. What's up? Hey, how you doing? Good, man. Hey, I got a question on, uh, my brother's been trying to get a divorce for two years from this woman, and he, and she has medical problems, and they had a child. He, uh, has not been able to do anything with the court. They keep putting him off, saying that she has to stay on his medical. Uh, she refuses to sign any of the divorce papers. Her, she's got a lawyer that just keeps, you know, running him around and around. And it's been two years now, and he still can't get on with his life. Yeah, he's being held hostage. Now, I, will, I will tell you this, that uh, sometimes, because I know a little about everything. I can wing it, and I can even have Rick Jones like kind of wink at me and go, that wasn't bad, but I'm not an expert. This one eludes me completely. I do not understand how somebody files for divorce and doesn't get a divorce for two years. How is that possible? I can see you fighting over the kids. I can see you fighting over the alley, uh, alimony, but I can't see you fighting to keep two people who hate each other in the same house and in the same marriage. Rick Jones, how is that done? Well, apparently it's both people or one of them having uh, no clue whatsoever. You don't. You can't do it. You can't make a guy stay, right? No. I mean, ultimately, if it's it's like a it's like a bicycle. There's two wheels. If one of them's broken, it's still not going to go. Your wife is like a bicycle. Everybody in town's had a ride on her. <laughs> well, I was bitching to say, but I'm telling you. So uh, Rick's right. I I thought this, but I was afraid to say because I've heard this before. That, that my divorce dragged on for years. They cannot make this man hostage. He can get a divorce. Then the child support. Then the alimony. All of that can come later. But he cannot be held hostage to this woman. Go get lawyered up. Call one eight hundred divorce and get the, get this woman off this guy's case. She cannot. Hold Hold him in a marriage he does not wish to be in. You got it? Yep, got it. Hey, thanks a lot. Right on. It was my absolute pleasure. All right, that is all the time we have for Danny Bonadici, Life Coach. I would like again thank to uh, like to thank my partner, who has only is the only guest ever to sit in on Life Coach, and I've been doing it for years. He's just so good at what he does. He's from Goldberg Jones. His name is Rick Jones. And if you find yourself in a jam and you want your uh, child support and you want your custody, you call one eight hundred divorce. Thank you, Rick. Thanks, Rick thank Jones. You. Hey, coming up next, stick around. It's Sarah's filthy forecast. <laughs> The Danny Bonaducci and Sarah Morning Show on the home of Classic Rock, 102.5 KZOK.